Ian, let's start off then. How did you find the uh, Meet the Head Coach fans forum last night? It was good. I enjoyed it. Um, nice to see. It was a really good turnout, actually, and lots of questions. Um, good to kind of go off track a little bit. And uh, normally the, the interviews that I do are the get just before the game or just after the game, and it's kind of a lot of similar themes. So it was good just to kind of go away from that, answer some of the questions, the wonderings of the fans and get to meet quite a few in person. So for me, it was a really, really good opportunity just to, to sit there and, and chat to them and, and hopefully give them a little bit of insight into what we're trying to do. And uh, yeah, I think it went down well in, in general. So hopefully they enjoyed it. Yeah, just how important is it to have that communication with them, I guess? It is. Um, like, you don't get that much interaction uh, on a on a day-to-day basis. You know, we're based down in, in Chippenham at the training ground and... Uh, you only kind of come across the fans on the match day. So any opportunity that we get in and around, you know, and certainly when I'm about and, and I bump into fans, it's always nice to, to spend time to chat to them. And certainly events like that are a really good opportunity to meet more of them. And we're in FA Cup action this weekend, as we can see from the boards behind you. Yeah. What does the FA Cup mean to you? I mean, I, I've only only last season, obviously, I haven't been abroad for the best part of eight years. Um my first real taste of proper FA Cup was last season with Notts County and it was good it was good just to to be a part of the competition it's obviously a really historic competition and growing up you always used to watch it on the TV and, and meant a lot so it's nice to be to be in it nice to be in the first round but obviously the target is always especially when you're lower down the leagues to just try and get as far as you can and, and get some interesting draws and, and uh, you know it's a really tricky one this weekend it certainly is an interesting draw. And how important is it to not underestimate South Shields, as I think you've discussed a couple of times already? Yeah, I mean, any team that can get to this point in the FA Cup has done remarkably well. And uh, certainly, I know there are a few divisions below us, but I think they've been pretty well backed in terms of bringing in some quality players. They've got a lot of players that have got some league experience. And um, Kevin Phillips, obviously, a really experienced uh, player, had a fantastic career. And I've watched uh, watched a couple of the games uh, yesterday and today I watched the game against Scunthorpe the game against FC United and Manchester and one thing I'll say is you can see that they're a really well coached team um, really well drilled a lot of players comfortable on the ball and and going away there obviously there's going to be a good atmosphere and a good turnout of local fans and they're always tricky games so um, we've got to be really really well prepared and and, um, and focused on the game How easy or hard has it been to get information on them obviously with the level they're playing at? Yeah, it's not not there's it's not as readily av- available as the the normal league games, but of course our, our analysts and uh, through some contacts we've managed to get copies of the games that they've been playing in recently. So we can get some footage on them, and and obviously one or two of the players have been about in the league, so we know a little bit about them. So we can get some information on them, but uh, probably not as in depth as as what we get on a normal league game. So, but I think we've got more than enough to prepare ourselves well. And you mentioned last night, it's about finding that balance, isn't it, between respecting the opposition and the competition, but also you said there will be some changes. How hungry are some of the players just to you know, go and get a taste of the FA Cup? Yeah, they all want to play. Uh, everybody wants to play and the competition's good, but we've obviously had one or two injuries which everybody knows about. One or two are quite close now, but whether or not they're quite ready or if we, if we think that we can risk them this weekend, I'm not so sure. So... Uh, we have to be a little bit cautious with that but at the same time I think there's good competition in there everybody wants to play but it's really important that we we understand the qualities that the opposition have got and that we don't underestimate them and that we go there and we go strong and and we, uh, we give it a best shot